So Caroline, who are they raising money for this year? Well, Ben, this year they are benefiting the Miracle League. They help out youth, adults, and veterans, all with disabilities, obtain sporting event opportunities. Trading their badges for hockey sticks. <laughs> Wilmington first responders came together for the seventh annual Guns and Hoses Hockey League. Hopefully, the police can lose it for this for us this year, and we can pull out a win. Firefighter Alan Lewis's team has lost the past two years, but he believes this year is different. I know we're prepared enough. For police, on the other hand, absolutely. The annual game may be for charity. But once that whistle blows, it's time to get down to business. Most of the first responders already have hockey experience on their side. Well, I grew up in the Northeast playing ice hockey on the ponds back home, and it's just a fun time. It's energetic. It's fast-paced. Corporal Peter Swartz even brought hockey to UNCW. Swartz, I, you know, I grew up playing in, in New England, and then I came down here and uh, started the UNCW hockey team years ago. Game faces and the luck of the Irish. Firefighters started with a strong lead. And they finish with a strong lead, ending their two-year losing streak, all for a good cause. And as you can see, the first responders weren't the only ones who loved that event. Fans filled the arena cheering on their favorite team with the final score of 7-2, your Wilmington Fire Department. Ben. Uh -huh.